running from all things at once without thinking twice. And I knew it would catch up and that we would be the ones left behind. The stories I've been told, they never seem to lead my mind. This road that I am on, I gotta stay here for some time. my friends welcome back to another vlog <laughs> to another day in the life how are you guys doing I hope everybody out there is doing well it's a crazy world we live in these are crazy times but my heart is at peace because I know I have my hope in Jesus I don't place my hope in this world thank God <laughs> this world is just a crazy place right now as we all know but <laughs> we can still find joy and hope so today is Tuesday uh, September 14th and I cannot believe we are halfway through September what happened like where did it go <laughs> where did it go it's crazy uh, I'm trying my new clear glasses again I'm gonna see if they give me a headache right along here they're like tight somebody was telling me put them over boiling water and like let this get soft and then um, bend it so if they do that again I'm gonna try I'm not sure if it was the glasses or something else but I haven't worn them for like a week so I'm gonna try them again I really do like them so anyway today's Tuesday and we are I mentioned in another vlog that we are doing um, online school homeschool whatever for a little while because Jackson's school there was a lot of people out that had been exposed to COVID-19 and so um, you know when you're when you've been around someone that was diagnosed you know you have to be in quarantine so too many teachers too many students were out so they decided to take a break which a lot of the school districts around here have done and some of them went back yesterday but ours doesn't go back until next monday so he is doing online school this week he's doing really great and it only takes him about three hours and he's been done since like 12 45 so um it took him a little longer today but anyway i'm loving the kind of easier days i don't know for some reason i just love the easier days when <laughs> it's not that super strict schedule but today jackson starts soccer practice because uh, he's gonna be playing for the y and i had to go buy him some cleats and he has man size feet so soccer cleats for a man are not cheap <laughs> so um i said don't take the tags off till we get there and we see that everybody's there and this is for real because He's played soccer since he was four through different organizations, but last year, last spring 2020, he was just about to start a new team and COVID-19 shut everything down. So we, we didn't get to play all last year and the, or in the spring. And then now this fall, he's finally getting to, and he's at the very end of the eligibility for age. So anyway, I'm glad that he gets to play this time. So he'll be able to play fall and then next spring. Hopefully there's enough um, in his age group to spread out throughout the teams. But anyway, I'm excited for him to be on a team again. I've always loved uh, just watching him play sports. And it's never about winning and, and being the best. It's just about like team. I think it's so good for kids to learn um, teamwork. And, you know, in soccer, you have to, well, like any sport, you have to use teamwork if you want to score a point or whatever. But it's just the com camaraderie. He's always had the best coaches and he's made good friends. and. Anyway, I'm excited. It's a new uh, chapter, so it'll go, it's just this month and next month, so it doesn't last too long. And so uh, tonight, it, or today, it's like 91 or 93 for the high, so it's gonna be a hot practice. But um, I, I'm not sure if I'm gonna make dinner. I'm probably gonna wait until we get back because we ate lunch kind of like a little later. I wanna vlog today just cause um, I need to get, a, I trying to get three videos a week out. I did vlog this past weekend and it's gonna be a long one. We got, uh, you'll see that before this video. Hopefully you will already seen that too. 
but we got our new refrigerator and I love it. It's amazing. It's the first time in my 47 years that I've had a brand new refrigerator, so I love it. <laughs> and um, Marion was like, is that our third new appliance ever? And I'm like, no, it's like our fifth, but it's the first refrigerator. And the first one I got to go and choose and it's beautiful and so much bigger. And hopefully you saw that. I'll link it above if you did not see that weekend vlog but it was a long one too we were busy i don't even remember oh yeah my sister's in town she's been in town from california and so we had her over and i got to have all my kids and their spouses and you know it's rare to get everybody together other than like a holiday because everybody is so busy and they all work different shifts and different days and i wish they all worked like nine to five monday through friday but they don't <laughs> anyway i've talked long enough but i just wanted to welcome you back to this day in the life and get this vlog started because it's like afternoon now and Yep, just not picking up the camera. What you doing? You trying to stay cool on the floor? It's a hot day today. I know it. It is a hot day today. I painted my um, vent in the bathroom black and I love it. And this thing is a piece of trash, but I might paint that one too. Like somebody was saying that one of you guys said you, you did it in all, on all your vents and I just might do it. I actually really like the way it looks. So, And this right here, Lord have mercy. I'm going to probably take all that off see it's like <laughs> I'm probably it's this rope I'm probably gonna take it off and just like put some new rope on it because look he's starting to tear this up he loves his scratching post don't you my boy he loves that scratching post and I don't want him scratching furniture so I need to find some rope to redo that here's my new fridge if you haven't seen it yet it's so beautiful it's a whirlpool I don't know anything else about it except it's a whirlpool side by side and I have so much more room it's amazing I'm so, so grateful. Like I said, I've never had a new refrigerator before. My last one I got on Craigslist for like 200 bucks and I've had it for like 10 years and it served us well and we were able to give it away to a family that really needed one. So that was awesome, passed it on to somebody else and then uh, God just provided this one. So I love it, so grateful for it. And um, I know probably some of y'all are wondering when maybe I'm gonna be doing my fall decorating if you care about that kind of thing. A lot of people don't care about that kind of thing. But if you do, I do have this uh, pile of fall stuff right here. But I plan on, I, I keep moving when I plan on doing it because things are so busy and I wanna really be able to bring everything up that I have and go through it all. Like it's gonna be a process because I don't wanna just put a few things up and then like, I, I just, I ha we're, we're gonna be doing a big, huge declutter in our basement once Madison moves out and then like I have a blank slate down there we're gonna like declutter everything hopefully <laughs> it might take a while and then I'm gonna pull out all my fall stuff and then probably get rid of like half of it because my house is too small for as much fall stuff as I have but I do have a few new things and I'm, I'm excited to put everything up so it's gonna be later for me than everybody else on YouTube but it's usually that way anyway because if I put it up too early I just get tired of it and it just kind of annoys me so and you know I'll leave it up until I start until I put Christmas stuff up so it just seems so early but not knocking anybody who's already put it up I mean I understand like once September 1st comes, I want to too. And I do want to. I look at my stuff, I'm like, I really just want to put that out because I got some really cute things. But I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait until I can do it properly. So it's going to be sometime this month. It will be in September. I don't know exactly when though. This is really fun. I've never had a refrigerator do this before. <laughs> it's the little things, you know. I'm just watching Marina, well, Shane giving a um, <laughs> grocery haul. Fearfully created. Are these my favorite? Those, are those my favorite chicken? I don't know. I can never find them anymore. But that's my favorite salad, Marina. Anyway, look at this sweet boy. He just wants to be my mama. Look how big he is. was so handsome. Okay, got some laundry done. Switched it out, put a, load, put a load away. I forgot to buy Jackson a new water bottle when we went and got his cleats. So I'm just gonna have to use the one that we have here. But I like those like Gatorade water bottles. 
anyway, I guess he will use this one for today. Ready for soccer practice? First soccer practice. Feels good to be back. It actually doesn't feel so hot. <laughs> what is going on? Feels really nice out here, like really nice. Let's see what the temperature is. 68. Definitely not in the 90s, I wouldn't say. It's not like muggy. And I get no service. So we are home now for soccer. I am making dinner and I, you know, I was watching Marina. If you don't watch her, her channel is called Fearfully Created and she had Waffle House and it just sounded so good. She had a bacon, egg and cheese sandwich. So Marina, if you're watching, thanks for the idea. It looked so good. So. And then she had hash browns, and Waffle House has the best hash browns. So anyway, I was gonna make nachos tonight, and I was just sitting there thinking, I don't wanna make nachos, I don't want nachos, I want a bacon egg and cheese sandwich and hash browns. So I, um, ha I'm making these Simply Potatoes. I stopped and got Jackson something to drive through. He was too hungry, but, um, and it's like 7.45, and that is so late for us, but I am, making dinner so I'm making some hash browns I'm also gonna make a few of my breakfast burritos because I don't have any more and I really I really like to eat those in the morning so I'm gonna make a few um, you know extra pieces of bacon and some eggs and then I can freeze those so I can do what I eat in a day video because so many of you all have asked but I love turkey bacon this is the one I usually buy I'm just gonna like do some eggs um, make some toast, put them together. It's gonna be good. I'm actually, I wasn't that hungry earlier, but now that it's almost eight o'clock, I'm starving. So, and then I'm gonna clean my kitchen and then I'm gonna call it a night. breakfast burritos I'm just gonna make four but I have had people ask me how I make them or to show it so I'll just show you I'm gonna put eggs cheese bacon and hash browns and I use these low-carb tortillas so this time I'm using um, American cheese I use cheddar or American this time I'm just using American
So I put those in the freezer and then I made my sandwich, bacon, egg, and cheese. I didn't have enough hash browns to eat tonight too, but that's okay. I'll have this and probably some fruit. Well, that was delicious. I really wish I had two of them, <laughs> but um, I think I'm gonna end the vlog like I do most of the vlogs. I'm gonna clean my kitchen. Um, I think I'm gonna wipe down my cabinets because I was noticing whenever I have my glasses on and I like bend down like, oh, I need to clean, wipe them off. So I'm just gonna unload and reload the dishwasher and wipe the cabinets off. And then I think I'm gonna be done. It's already 8.30, so. to be the one you can trust I feel so useless cause I let you down I hope there's some way I can make it alright cause I know that you deserve much more than this if you give me one more chance I swear I'll try my best to always be there and I
Cause I want you to show me what you feel You're watching me like you want me But you're still holding back, still holding back Honestly, you're annoying me With the way that you keep playing Show me your love like it is, like it is And open my heart like you're fearless Still on the go So I did scrub my stove, come on, my stove top and then all around the oven and above it and I realized when I was done that I wasn't recording it so I'm not going to do it again just for video's sake but I am going to stop for now, it's 9 o'clock and um, yeah, I'm going to probably try to catch up on a little bit of editing. What do you need my love, huh? Mwah. My sweet boy. Um, but anyway, I have lots of videos coming up, so make sure that you're subscribed. Um, we're just going to be really busy. You know, this time of year, it's just really busy. It's like from now until the holidays. So, But it's good stuff, and I'm excited. So I hope that uh, you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. If you like these kind of day in the life, you know, this is the majority of what I do on my channel. Cooking and cleaning and homemaking, that's what I want my channel to be about. So... Uh, anyway, I love you guys so much. You know that and I appreciate you every single one of you for for watching and for commenting and sharing and all the things. So I'm going to say goodnight. I'll leave you with a beautiful scripture and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <music>